Welcome to this Windows and Computer channel and uh, this is a update on the uh, situation of the October 2018 update. So we are of course January 17th, 2019. It's been um, three months, more than three months since the first release of version 1809 and of course the story that goes with it is was released on October 2nd, pulled, re-released in uh, mid-November and it's been rolling out very very slowly and I still get a lot of people saying hey I don't have this appearing is, is, is this normal I don't have it when I go to Windows Update it is and don't worry about it it's been rolling out very very slowly they're not taking any chances they've already had too many problems with it but now with the bug fixes and the updates that were actually pushed to fix the major issues the October 2018 update will now start rolling out really, really faster. So starting um, pretty much today, the October 2018 update is going to be pushed to everybody that has a computer that's compatible, that doesn't have any issues at all, hardware that might not be compatible, or software that might not be compatible. That means you will, in the next, uh, and it's in waves, so in the next few weeks, uh, you should see this appear on your Windows updates. So this is the last major update that we have for now. And you know, we're getting close. We're already halfway through the next version, 19H1, that will uh, be rolling out sometime in April, probably. So uh, it's time for Microsoft to start pushing this. And it's going to be interesting to see by the end of January uh, where we are at. We know that at the end of December, we were still only 6% of Windows 10 users had this version of October 2018 update and um, I expect that number to be um, much higher by the end of January uh, by uh, pushing it now. If you don't see it uh, that simply means that there's something that they still need to work on that will um, of course make this update um, available to you don't worry. Also, it's in waves, so it's not like they're not pushing everybody at the same time. They're going uh, through waves of upgrades. That means that a select number of users, the machines probably that are the most uh, compatible, the ones that they know are pretty much not going to have any problem, are the ones being pushed first, and slowly the other ones will get it in the next few weeks. So just be patient. It will arrive at some point, but now the uh, update process is getting faster and quicker, so you uh, might not have to wait that long for this to appear on your computer. So that's the latest update we have. Uh, for those wondering, it is okay now. You know, I mean, they fixed the major bugs, and um, this should actually work well. It doesn't mean that you know 100% of all you out there will be okay. It means that there will still always be a very small percentage of people that sometimes have problems. But for the majority of you out there. Uh, it should be okay. I mean, I've got it here. And most people that have upgraded, even with the problems, didn't have any problems. So um, I think it's uh, a safe update to do now. Uh, but wait for it. You know, don't push it. Don't go to the website to download it or to upgrade from the Windows 10 website. Wait for it to be pushed to you rather than uh, forcing it on your PC. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe. Give us a thumbs up. Thank you for watching.